Hi, Michaela Harris here. I want to take just a few minutes today to show you what you could be doing to generate more customers online and grow your business. So first things first, my number two, my two top recommendations for any company looking to grow is going to be make sure you have a good quality, correctly built website that is optimized to get to that first page of Google. And of course, a Google business profile. Now I'm going to get into what you can do to these two things more in just a moment. But for now, I want to show you what the potential is for growth for your company. So first off, I see that with the town of North Carolina that you're in, um, you actually did come up in a Fayetteville search for me. So I wanted to go with Fayetteville just because I realized it's about 40 minutes away. And that, of course, it's going to have a pretty high search volume. I want to show you the potential. Now, of course, what I'm doing today can be done for any neighboring town that you service. Any different service that you offer. I'm just going to show you one example of landscaping in Fayetteville just to show you what potential is really out there. Of course, there's going to be volume for other services and other towns. So just with that being said, first things first, um, when I, as a potential customer, come in and search landscaping Fayetteville, North Carolina, this is what we call a keyword. Now this is a special one, it's called a buyer intent keyword. It just means that when someone searches this, they're making the search with the intent to make a purchase of a product or service. That's what's important. Those are gonna be the ones that are gonna be potential customers for you, rather than people just looking for random information. So as a potential customer searching that word, I'm gonna see the top three businesses and maps and this first page of organic URLs. Now, nine out of 10 people never gonna make it to the second page. Most won't click more businesses. You wanna be as easy as possible for your customer to find, and that's gonna be being in the top three of maps, being on the first page of Google for whatever keyword you're targeting. In this case, I'm giving the example of landscaping Fayetteville. So, Harris & Harris is actually the top competitor for this area um, in both maps and in the organic URLs. Now, these two rank separately. So in order to rank in the top three here, you're going to want to get that Google business profile made, which you just go to your Google account, go to your apps and create a business profile. So when you do this, you're going to want to make sure that you fill out all the information, get the business profile verified. And then of course you want to make sure that your company description utilizes as many of those 750 words as you're allowed as possible. Now, when you do this, you're going to want to um, throw in a couple good keywords in there as well, just so that Google knows you're relevant. Then you're going to want to go get more reviews, citations, and photos than your top competitors. Now, those citations are just directory sites like Yelp or Yellow Pages that list your name, address, and phone number. Now, once you go get more of those than your top competitors, over time, you're going to rank above them. Then, when it comes to your website, you're going to want to rank in this top part of the first page in order to maximize on the amount of people searching this word clicking on your website. So like I said, Harris and Harris Lawn Care is your top competitor. However, their site is currently under construction. So I'm going to show you their website statistics, but for the website example, I'm going to show you your second competitor for Fayetteville, which would be Cardinal Landscaping. So when you go in to create a website, I recommend using something like WordPress or Snaps. Now, those two platforms are my favorite. They're the, one that you, well, the ones that are the easiest to work with and have the best results with ranking. So with that, I want you to see that you need your homepage to have about 1,500 words of good relevant content with keywords throughout that content. And then you want to make sure any images on your entire website save as keywords. You want to make sure your locations and your services are listed on separate pages. So locations, those back pages can be ranked in different areas and those back pages are going to be easier to rank than your entire website for the different areas you service. And of course, same thing with your services, anything like landscaping, hardscaping, whatever it is that you offer, list them on separate service pages so that you can rank for each one of those separately. Now, if I take a look at the statistics behind Harris and Harris Lawn Care, you can see here there you are and their DR is really low. Now this is a trust and a power rating influenced by backlinks. Backlinks are just links from other websites back to yours. If these links are low quality or spammy, it's going to hurt you 
in the ranking process not help you. So you want to make sure these are high quality, powerful links that are relevant to what your website's about. However, the most important thing here are those keywords and knowing which ones to target. So if I take a look at the keywords they're ranking for, lawn care, Fayetteville, North Carolina, 250 searches a month. Landscaping, 300. Landscapers, 200. And I can continue to go down this list. Here, 150. Sod and turf, if you do that, there's 100 searches. Fayetteville Lawn Care, 100. And I can continue to go down this list. There are several hundred people searching for your services every month just within Fayetteville. Of course, if you serve any other neighboring town or city, again, you can search each of these separately. Find the keywords for the services and the service areas that you offer. There are several hundred people out there looking for a company just like yours. And in order to capitalize on all of that search volume, you're going to want to get a correctly built optimized website with good backlinks and a correctly optimized Google business profile with good citations. Again, huge potential for growth here for your company. I hope that you see that. Please don't hesitate to reach out if you have any questions. I would love to get a few lines of feedback from you just so that I know this is helpful. Thanks so much for taking the time to watch and I hope you have a great rest of your day.